Hey, what's up you guys? I am back with another video. I'm gonna show you guys how I do a wet look using clip-ins. These clip-ins were sent to me and they match my hair perfectly. I think I found a good combination of gels to do this. Shout out to Kimberly Sherelle. I saw this wet look from her and I also saw this wet look um, on Naturally Nisi's channel. And I was like, why not try it on my really, really kinky hair? So I'm gonna show you guys how I do it. My hair is actually stretched right now because I had it in some bantu knots, but I wanna try it on my hair. So I have some tools, comb, dim, and brush. The um, Uncle Funky's Daughter Curly Magic Curl Stimulator. That was the perfect gel combined, light gel combined with the Eco Styler Black castor and black seed oil gel so i'm going to use those things and of course you know i have to seal because my hair is very very coily so in order for my hair to lay down really really well i'm gonna have to use some main choice hair type four leaf clover stubborn edges freezing gel Whew, that was a lot okay um i did a little braid to the back i already defined my Clipping. Now I'm gonna work on defining the top of my hair. Let me put my clippings in so I can know what I'm working with in terms of fullness. So, okay, so like I said, I've used I've used these clippings before. Didn't know, um, well, I know the curl pattern and the curl pattern is really, really bomb. It's really, really coily, similar to my hair. And of course, these are now dyed. So, so pretty much for the wet look, it is trying to pretty much maintain that wet look <laughs> throughout the day and so forth. So I think it's a pretty cool hairstyle for the summer. So you see how thick that is already? I know I'm gonna space out from now on. And this is literally all I'm gonna put in my hair. The reason I'm doing this is because I wanna add one in between my hair at some point. Um, yeah. So, now we're gonna work on, actually, let me put this in a pony to separate from everything else. Okay. I'm hoping my hair dries properly. Now I'm gonna use the main choice spray, type four spray leave-in because I don't wanna interrupt anything with my um, gels. And the reason I decided to do clippings as well is because I do know for a fact that my hair is not really, really long and it's definitely going to shrink up a whole lot. So, so let's clear out again with a wide tooth comb. See? And I'm going to go in with a little bit more. I'm gonna go in with my Denman brush. Now you definitely have to get those roots. <laughs> I saw Kimberly use the Mayel Organics 
I think it's Mayal Organic, Mayal? Anyway, Mayal product on over top of gel, I think, or she went first. So I'm gonna put this Uncle Funky's Daughter Gel last. And she also used the a ball bristle brush at a brush at her roots. I'm not gonna do that specifically because I know my hair type, and I'm I'll be literally um, breaking my hair kind of. So. It is pretty laid. Now here's what I'm going to do. To keep my hair kind of laid, I'm going to go back in with this scrunchie and I'm going to add that to it because I know my hair. I just want y'all to know this is a very messy hairstyle. So if you're going to try it, be prepared. All right, so I have one more clip in. hoping it still looks a bit flat <laughs> for the wet part of the look. I'm hoping it flows and comes together the way I would like. So, now that that part is completed, what we're gonna do is my edges. Now, as you guys know, my edges are kind of thinning. So in order to make it look cute, I'm gonna have to fill it out a little bit with some Okay, now I'm going to add main choice, type four leaf clover onto my edges. I don't have, I'm doing it much softer than usual, trying to not put too much um, pain on my edges. Okay, so I'm gonna put this 
right on top so they don't move. I have to do this because I have a lot of flyaways and this helps to seal all flyaways. Yeah. I'm gonna tie it down, but I'm gonna have much more cloth out. Of course, you can see I'm following all of the girls' steps, right? If you watch her video, you'll be able to tell. Don't mind my dirty hair cloth. And I'm going to Child, I got this idea from Kimberly. I thought it was a really cool idea. I'm gonna do my makeup and we'll see what it looks like once I'm done. Hopefully it's cute and I like it. I'm gonna wait a few minutes before I hop in the shower though. Now, how am I going to hop in the shower with this? Lord, didn't think about that. I will, so I will be right back. Yeah, he sets my body in motion. He just, he knows how to turn things up. And he knows what gets me going. Yeah, like a little text saying, hey, what's up? Look at me, I'm in a bad situation Look at him, he's got a bad reputation They be looking at us Thinking we are too much Look at me, I'm in a bad situation Look at him, he's got a bad reputation They be looking at us mm. This is how it turned out You probably can't see a slight line of demarcation To where my hair stops But that's totally fine I think it's cute Um, Yeah let me know what you think about this hairstyle in the comments below. I decided to try the wet look because I've seen Naturally Nisi's video as well as Kimberly Sherelle's video. And I thought it would be a good idea if I tried it on my coily coily hair. However, of course I had to add clip-ins for the sake of the video. For the length, for the look, I think my hair is too short and it will poof out too much. So I had to improvise. But I think it turned out pretty cute. Let me know what you guys think. I think it is pretty adorbs. Yeah, so we'll see what it looks like in the next hour or so. And you can follow me on Instagram. And you can probably see how it turned out. And I will definitely give my thoughts and leave my thoughts there. So yeah, guys, this is the finished look. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. If you see any flyaways, you can always go back in and add some more gel to that area. But I think it turned out pretty cute. I used the 90s clips. And these are what... We use back in the day. Everything that I use will be left in the linked and left in the description box. And you can let me know how you like this look. If it came out cute on me. Um, and on my really coily 4C, 4B hair. Because I know my hair is 4C, 4B. Ain't no question about that. Because I am far from the A category. Period. Thank you guys for watching this video. Hopefully you guys enjoy. I love it. So yeah. That's what it came out like. Period. Pie.